In the Quran, Surah 8, or chapter 8, portions of Surah 8 deal with the Battle of Badar. Let me quote to you. After the victory, Muhammad allegedly got this revelation, I will strike terror into the hearts of those who disbelieve. Therefore, strike off their heads and strike off every finger, the tip of them. This is because they acted adversely to Allah and to his apostle. And whoever acts adversely to Allah and his apostle, then surely Allah is severe in requiting evil. This, taste it, and know that for the unbelievers, it is the chastisement of fire. This is what God allegedly revealed to Muhammad. I will strike terror into their hearts. Coptic Christians have been suffering since the life of Muhammad himself. In the museum at Istanbul, formerly Constantinople, you can see a copy of the original letter. Muhammad sent a copy to the leader of the Coptic Christians and, sent and kept one for himself. In it, he threatens the leader of the Copts, come to Islam, receive honor, the honor of bringing your people to the true religion, if you don't, then the disaster which is to befall you and your people rests with you. It is a threatening letter. Muhammad set his eyes on Egypt, set his eyes on the Coptic Christians, and said, convert or face severe consequences. And those consequences exist until this day. And so when these devout Muslims follow the narrative of Muhammad, they are trying to be devout. It's not about money. It's about Muhammad. We're going to talk more on tomorrow's episode about having the courage to simply say these words, to say the truth, that this is about Muhammad.